All right, you guys, I'm going to give you a quick lesson on how to work a torque wrench. Okay, so the torque wrench right here, uh, you can go by, let's see, let me show you here. You can go by the torques, by foot pounds, okay? So here's the foot pounds. This side is, it goes by 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 180. And you have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, uh, 120, 140, okay? So it goes up to one. 80 I believe is that no actually to 150 okay yeah so 150 goes up to 150 so this part here right here these are the ones so we got the tens and then we have then like the twenties alright so 20 40 60 80 and 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 110 okay on this side so then these are the ones so say like if I want we wanted to torque this to and then down here actually is where you unlock it at okay right here this part here is where you unlock it so we have to unlock it I'm holding the camera so let's see if I can do this so if we're gonna unlock it we unlock it like this and say okay so that's unlocked so say like we're gonna torque it to 30 Let's not even go that high. Let's say we're just going to say what we're at right now. We just we'll spin this right here. So we just spin this. Because I can't turn it with my hand. So we'd spin this. Just say I'm spinning it. And then we'd go on the line. Right now we're at... We're at 20... 2... Actually, between 22 and 23. So we just put it... Say like if we wanted to go to... Uh, We're actually at 10, we're at 10, we're at 12, we're right at 12, so if this was lined up more, right here, this part lined up on here, let's see, let me try to spin without, okay, so, now, so we're at 12, so you just spin it up to the line of the 10, and then say like if you wanted to go to 12, say like it was uh, 12 foot-pounds, you would just spin it to the 10, get it up to the 10, you'd put it to 10, and then you would move this to the 2, and then you'd be at 12. You'll see it when you when you do it. I mean, if you're going to be, if you're going to have a torque wrench, you're going to basically know how to basically work a tool, so it's not going to be that hard. I just wanted to show you guys real quick. Oh yeah, then like the other side, too. You can do it in metric, I guess. Metric pounds. Yeah, metric pounds and metric grams. So if you guys want to use those, if that's what it shows on your guys. It has the same number lineup, basically. Um, just take a look here. You'll see it. But yeah, uh, for the American standard, we do it by the uh, foot pound. So, But there it is. It's pretty simple just spin it oh yeah and then down here after you spin it make sure you lock it back in though you have to lock it back in so you just turn this all the way back and we're locked in and we are locked into 10 to we're locked into 12 see so zero starts there these are the ones zero one two three four the in-betweens you have to look at the in-between ones too so but yeah so zero then one is that line, and then of course when we go to two, three, four, and so on. And it goes all the way around to eight, nine, it goes to nine. Yeah, yeah, so it go to nine, okay? So it's that easy. You guys just, uh, once you uh, get torque wrench in your, your, your hand, you'll be able to see if you get this kind. They actually have digital ones too, so just uh, take a look and it's uh, pretty simple. I just wanted to show you guys that real quick. Alright, have a great day. And uh, like my video, subscribe. Have a good day. Till the next video.